Let me tell you about what the patients can expect on the day of the procedure. They come in and we, we go over all their paperwork. Usually they've read it already, but we'll review it, make sure they, they have all their questions answered. Then I'll examine their eyes, make sure that everything looks perfect still and that the eyes look great and ready to go for the procedure. We'll also give them a pill uh, called Xanax, which is just going to relax them a little bit. It's not going to knock them out. So people are going to be cooperative during the surgery. They're going to be awake, but they're going to be relaxed. So we give them a little pill. And for that reason, they need a driver on the day of the procedure. So they're going to come in with a driver. Um, they can expect to be in the center for about an hour and a half. After we've given them the pill and we've gone over um, the paperwork, answered all their questions, I go through kind of a little pep talk with the patient and I explain to the patient what the procedure is going to be like. I explain some tips and some pearls that's going to help them go through the procedure in a more controlled way and a more relaxed way. So we go over that and we spend about five minutes explaining uh, what the procedure will be like to them and, and then we walk back to the OR. The OR is a very uh, relaxed environment. You can see I have a teddy bear back here. We give the, the women the teddy bear to hold on to, which is something that, that makes them feel comfortable. I have footballs for guys. Um, and we usually play really nice music. Sometimes we play, um, we play games with the music. We'll play uh, Name That Tune during the procedure. It, it's kind of a very relaxed atmosphere um, while we're working. The entire procedure is designed to keep you relaxed, but to provide you with the optimal result. The first step of the procedure is called intralase. The intralase procedure is where we make the flap. It's a bladeless procedure. There's no blades used whatsoever. Um, so it's basically kind of a no-touch procedure. It's all laser. That intralase procedure creates the flap. It takes about 25 seconds to do that, during which time the vision darkens for the patient and there's a mild pressure sensation. The patients that are calm and are going with the flow and are feeling comfortable, which is most everybody, uh, feels very either no pressure whatsoever or mild pressure. Um, so we really want to keep the, the anxiety level low and, and like I said everything's designed to keep the patient's anxiety level very low. After we're done with intralase, we then move the patient under another machine which is going to fix the vision and that's called an eczema laser. We have two of the very best eczema lasers here at the center and we will choose which one of those two eczema lasers to use based on some of the patient's previous wave scans or, or scan results that we have uh, performed on their eyes. So we will move the patient to the second laser and during that time they're going to be looking at a blinking light. There's going to be some sounds, some zapping sounds and they're uh, uh, and during that time, they're just looking at the light, just thinking, you know, is my face still? Am I breathing? And I'm talking to them, coaching them through that. Again, we're playing music, and it's usually a very, very uh, calming atmosphere. When we're finished with that, we're all done. Uh, the whole thing takes about 10 minutes. I look at their eyes. Um, usually people are, you know, uh, jumping up and very, very happy that they can see. Um, and uh, we, we look at their eyes, and then they go home. There's going to be a little stinging and burning that occurs on the way home when the numbing drops wear off, but we provide the patient with a numbing drop that they can use on their way home. And the main thing to do is to go home and take a three-hour nap because the three-hour nap is going to work wonders, and when you wake up, it's, it's like a miracle. All the burning and tearing is gone. The vision is much better, and, and that's when people are really, really happy. The next day, most people are able to go to work, drive, and get back to their normal routines.